Thailand is one of the signatory to the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea 1982 or UNCLOS 1982 since the year opening for signatory. However, Thailand has just ratified the convention in 2011. Part of the convention specified the right and responsibility for fishing, but Thailand did not enact the internal laws to accommodate this provision. In addition, FAO has defined the Code of Conduct for Responsible Fisheries in 1995 and in 2001 recommended the International Plan of Action to prevent, deter and eliminate illegal, unreported and unregulated fishing or IPOA, IUU for nations to adopt the Fisheries Management for Sustainable Fisheries. In the end, the European Union, who is one of the major seafood importers of the world, has adopted such plan and legalized the IUU regulation in 2010 for the exporter to be complied with to ensure that all imported seafood are not originated from IUU fishing activities. The IUU fishing activities include Fishing vessel that is not registered Fishing without license Fishing with invalid license or not approved from the coastal states Fishing without logbook or records of the catch not correct corresponding to the court species and vessel monitoring systems record Fishing in a prohibited area or seasonal closure or exceeding the allowable quota using prohibited fishing method or banned fishing gears duplicated, covered or hindered the vessel registration conceal the evidence hinder the investigation procedure of the officials bring the fish smaller than the allowable size on board or transfer it to other vessels transfer catch from illegal fishing vessel Fishing not according to the conservation measure Using a non-flag of convenience or stateless vessel and according to the international law From such international standard, it was found that Thailand may fall into having IUU fishing activities which are sometimes very much complicated problems such as duplicated vessel registration, duplicated fishing license, fishing gear not corresponding to the license, especially the destructive gear. All these resulted to that European Union put Thailand on formal notice for not taking sufficient measures in the international fight against illegal fishing, also called the yellow card, early on this year. The European Union let Thailand solve the problem for six months before putting Thailand in the non-compliance list or so-called the red card which may lead to the ban on Thai seafood products. The fisheries problem in Thailand has been neglected for so long and it linked to the ineffective management. But also most importantly is that the food security of the nation may be affected due to the collapse of the marine resources. <laughs>